Hey, Ankeny Free Church, Todd here. I wanted to give you some Holy Week updates. Uh, first, uh, we are having a resurrection egg scavenger hunt. Um, this is not just for the kids, adults too, um, but on Good Friday, we'll have various houses that will have pictures. You stay in your cars, you don't get out, you don't get things, um, and you drive around with a sheet that'll tell you uh, different parts of the resurrection story. It'll end at the church where you will be able to, uh, for the kids to receive a goodie bag and for everybody to have a, a COVID safe uh, blessing prayed over you by one of the staff. Uh, this is an exciting time. So Friday uh, at three o'clock, that's when the houses will be ready. Uh, staff will be at the church from five to seven to give you COVID safe bags and blessings. And then after that, you'd be able to share this with anybody. Um, the houses will have the pictures up on Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. And so uh, friends, whoever wants to go and have a retelling of the resurrection egg story um, can, uh, can do that. Uh, there are instructions about that below. Second, um, we are having a fast on Good Friday. Our denomination, the Evangelical Free Church of America, along with other denominations and many other movements, are calling for a fast on Good Friday from sunup to sundown. We ask that you would participate in that. Three, we are having devotional readings every day at 11 o'clock. Uh, these will tell us um, the week before what happened in Jesus' life as he's being led to the cross. Make sure you don't miss that. Um, we will not have a Good Friday service, um, but the devotional on Good Friday uh, will be longer and will remind us of Christ's death. Four, uh, don't forget the He is Risen photos that you or your family should take. Just simply uh, take a picture of yourself holding a He is Risen sign, and uh, we will be uh, using those on Easter, and hopefully that'll be something that you can post yourself on re Easter. You can use hashtag he is risen, and it'll be a great way to remind us of uh, Jesus's resurrection this upcoming Sunday. Fifth, uh, also a reminder from Sunday, uh, we do have a benevolence this week. You can do that through our online giving, but also throughout this week, if we have giving that exceeds our weekly need, all of that will go also directly into benevolence for those in need. I want to close here with a passage about Jesus. We're reminded of what he did for us in Isaiah 53, 5 and 6. He was wounded for our transgressions. He was crushed for our iniquities. Upon him the chastisement that brought us peace, and with his stripes we are healed. All we like sheep have gone astray. Each of us has turned, every one to his own way. But the Lord has laid upon him the iniquity of us all. Thank you, Ankeny Free.